Good day. Hello, this is Dr. John Bennett broadcasting from Miami Beach, Florida, and another of Neurosurgical Super Sundays. Today we have the pleasure of having Ip Sherian. He's the, uh, he's the head of the Nepal Neuroscience Center in Bharatnagar, uh, Nepal, and he's going to be speaking today about MCA aneurysms. But first, let me go around and introduce the panel. Uh, hello, Duong. How are you today? Unmute, uh, Duong. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh, hello, John. Hi, everybody. I'm fine. I'm waiting for Super Sunday. It's uh, an interesting topic. Okay. Nice to meet one of you. Okay. Uh, Duong is from Vietnam. Uh, yes. Welcome, Duong. Akmai, could you please introduce yourself? Oh, hi everyone. I'm, my name is Ahmad. I'm final year medical student from Indonesia, but I will be neuro, uh, neurosurgery resident on September. Great, great. Just starting. Vanta, can you hear me okay? Vanta? Uh, I don't think Vanta's audio is working. Okay, I, welcome. Could you please introduce yourself and, and, and your people in the room there? We'd like to meet them all. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, John, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you. Yeah, uh, John, uh, I am Aib Sharian. I work in Nepal. So uh, the people who will be talking on this would be uh, my friends uh, Eugenio, Yuan, and uh, Ahmed. So they will be showing you the PowerPoint presentation as well as uh, the video of this surgery. Uh, yes, you're welcome. Thanks. Please go ahead. Hi. Hi. Can you hear me? Hi. Hello. Could you introduce yourself, please? Yes, yes. Uh, my name is Eugenio Cerezo. I'm from Venezuela. Uh, and now I doing the fellowship with Dr. Shivian uh, from since about uh, two or three weeks. Uh, uh, I we here with Juan Juan Lopez. And uh, well, okay, uh, bienvenidos, bienvenidos. Gracias, gracias. I, I, I apologize for my English. Well, está bien, está bien. Podemos, we can understand. Okay, thank you, thank you. So, okay. uh, are you going to present? Yes. Yeah, he is going to present. So, uh, he will start screen okay. sharing now. Okay. Right. So, share screen and then. Okay, I, yeah, you, know, you know, you're a pro, you know how to do it. Can you see, guys, see the screen? Uh, yes, I can see it, but you haven't turned it on. Huh? Yeah, uh, I, yeah okay, I Have see. You... Okay, I see it. Okay, it says, yeah, yeah, aneurysm clipping. You might get the screen a little better. I, I... There you go. There you go. Perfect. Right. Perfect. So uh, we present the case of a, a right M1 uh, analyst clipping. Uh, we do uh, this surgery about three days ago. And um, uh, this case is very interesting uh, because the dissection and the anatomy the, of the patient is not the usual uh, anatomy. In, uh, it, it was uh, really hard to Dr. Chirion uh, can do the resection of the CBA and the Sibian fissure. This is a, a 56 years old male patient that was presented in the emergency room uh, in, in May uh, 16, yes? Uh, around uh, 4, 4 p.m. with uh, four days of 
uh, uh, vomiting and a severe headache, okay? Uh, at the day of the admission, the, present, uh, the patient had a transient uh, loss of conscious level for five minutes, about five, uh, five minutes. Uh, in, in, on examination, at uh, the moment of the, uh, we examined the patient, he, he present a uh, neck rigidity, uh, huh? rigidity. Uh, the patient, by the moment of the uh, admission, uh, is oriented uh, with GCS of uh, 15, with uh, both pupil, pupils, symmetrics and reactive. Uh, uh, no present uh, any neuro neurological deficit with uh, uh, parameters uh, 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 in the normal, yes? Uh, the patient, uh, after the suspicion uh, of the uh, worst headache on, on his, of his life, uh, uh, we do a CT brain scan where in, uh, it show uh, spontaneous uh, arachnoid hemorrhage, yes? Uh, uh, along the uh, cilium fissure in the right side, on the right side. Uh, this is a CT scan. Please uh, note the presence of subarachnoid hemorrhage, uh, mainly in the uh, fissure and, and in the cilium veil of the right side. Yes. Here you can see better the detail of the CT scan. Uh, at the other side, we can see uh, a little presence of uh, blood, yes? Uh, we have here in presence of a fissure tree, a subarachnoid hemorrhage. And with these findings, uh, he is decided to uh, perform a angio CT, yes? In the angio CT, uh, uh, she demonstrate the present, we see the present uh, of uh, aneurysm in the MCA, specifically in the M1 segment of the uh, width uh, uh, present of the spans of the right uh, MCA and ACA. Like uh, we show here, we can see the, this is the aneurysm Yes, uh, at level of the bifurcation. Strictly, we see, we, we must say that this aneurysm is in, in, in M1. Yes, many, some authors uh, say uh, the bifurcation is the point of the transition between M1 and M2. But uh, the, the uh, major uh, uh, the most of the authors say the this point of transition of M1 to M2 is the knee of the uh, MCA, yes? Uh, at a level of the limit of the insula. Here can see also the spasm uh, of the MCA and ACA. If we compare uh, both sides, uh, we can see in the left side how uh, is more thick, yes? Uh, the MCA and the ECA, yes? Uh, or or the, in the right side, almost can see uh, uh, MCA, even in the uh, ACA, is very, very narrow, yes? Here you can see the dome of the aneurysm with a down orientation, yes? And uh, this uh, point is very important uh, to result uh, the presence of the branch, yes? It looks like three branch uh, or trifurcation of the uh, MCA. Here you can uh, see the posterior view 
he can uh, see the, the vertebral arteries, yes? Uh, so this, uh, that say this is a posterior anterior uh, view, yes? He can see other uh, projections, yes, of the aneurysm. Uh, in, in this one, uh, we can see a, a better the presence of the branches. Uh, so uh, it is uh, very important to preserve at the moment of the clipping. The, the pre patient for, uh, was uh, uh, prepared for surgery for clipping of the right in one uh, aneurysm. The surgery uh, was, uh, like I say before, was very, very tough, very hard, uh, with a, a, a carefully dissection, yes? Uh, uh, later, uh, we can see the the detail of the dissection uh, of the Sylvian fissure was uh, very, very difficult. Uh, but um, after the doing the clipping, uh, uh, no, no other inconvenience, uh, the, the, the aneurysm don't accident, uh, and uh, uh, never was sacrificed any uh, vein of the Sylvian fissure. Uh, uh, the clipping was uh, performed with two permanent covered clips. No, but no, 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 Nice. Can you okay. see John? Yes, we can see it very well. Okay, uh, this is the moment of the uh, open of the dura. We can see here uh, is a relative, uh, relative, uh, relative uh, tie brain. Yes. Here, can we see how is a, a presence of blood in the uh, CSF consistently with a patient with a, a ruptured aneurysm, accidented aneurysm. This moment is lifting the, the dura, yes, to continue with the this section. You can notice by the brain, it is the very debates and starting to yes. swell. It is important to know the, uh, the brain is going, going out, yes? Next, how can you, okay. The next step uh, after this dura uh, opening was to uh, perform a systemostomy, yes, to, to relax the brain.
In this moment, uh, Dr. Shirian is looking for optic nerve. So we can see drain uh, slowly the CSF. Uh -huh. Here, yes, do you see the optic nerve? Okay, and this moment is uh, draining the CSF of the system around the optic nerve. We can see how with a slight retraction, uh, the brain is relaxing. Here we can see the arachnoid adhesions that we should retire to open the optical carotidian triangle. Yes? This patient has a very large uh, uh, anterior clinal process. So uh, the, the visualization of the ICA was uh, uh, difficult to But uh, with patient, we, we can uh, uh, drain the CSF of the system to uh, relax, the, continue the relaxing of the brain. What is this? Huh? This is external to me too? Yes. Here is a... Okay. Here a, a, we continue the systemostomy, doing the systemostomy by... by open the optical carotid uh, triangle. This is the carotid, and this is the optic nerve. This is the third nerve, yes. This is the carotid, yes, lateral to the carotid. Uh, optic, carotid. Here the window is already open. Here in this area, the membrane of the is closed. Now the session is going on to. Identify and do good proximal control in the internal carotid in case if there is any eruption mm -hmm. during the cellular vision dissection. Like, 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 like the, uh, uh, the aneurysm is in M1, 
proximal control only with uh, carotid uh, in ICA uh, control is maybe not the better uh, we can do because uh, in the bifurcation of the carotid and the uh, MCA and ACA is if we put a temporal trip here the uh, uh, bleeding in case of the rotor of the aneurysm will, will continue will continue so the dissection here we uh, perform all, uh, all also um, dissection and the excision of the little quist membrane and continue uh, drain CSF. Here, yes, here uh, 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 we passed uh, uh, several minutes uh, trying to do the Sylvian dissection, yes? Uh, this vein is in the way, like, like you say, is in the way of dissection to find, to follow the carotid to the bifurcation in uh, in uh, MCA and ACA, but this the this vein was a uh, um, pain in the ass, I <laughs> <laughs> This vein was a very very big problem with uh, for us. And the other vein also the up it was a big problem. This is there now after. Uh, Releasing of the vein. So that's why we dissected off the vein. Yes, I never said. Already dissected and released. Here we, we try to, to find, yes, the bifurcation. This way, this way. You must understand that uh, the vein that we see here was literally parallel to this vein. So we had to develop this window. So this vein was parallel here. And so we couldn't go in front of this because this vein was crossing onto the frontal lobe. So we didn't want to take out that vein. So we went, we developed this window, and then now we are dissecting the MCA posterior to that vein. Yes, behind the, the vein, we can see the continue of the ICA. Here can we see the try to, to approach uh, uh, along the Syrian fissure, but it was really, really hard. Here is the bifurcation, yes, of the ICA in, in MCA and ACA. This is a good, good uh, uh, proximal control to a uh, clip, uh, temporal clip, in case of rupture, accidental rupture of the aneurysm. This is this this step is very, very important. Okay, here, yes, here. Uh, okay, <laughs> here can we see the aneurysm? Okay, the dome. 
now how uh, we have proximal control, we go to approach to aneurysm. Try to dissect the neck, yes, and the adhesions of the uh, uh, dome to can expose the neck and try to to clip. Okay. Yes. Yes. Small, uh, small size of the uh, one and the other one is small. This is the same video. Yes. Okay, so This is the dome of the aneurysm. Yes. Here can see uh, if if we can pay attention, we can see the pulsation of the blood inside of of aneurysm. Yes. He can see. Uh, branch, yes, the neck, we can see the, the yes. complex of the dome. And presumably the site of rupture was in the top because this has these additions on to the parenchyma. So we can try to not touch this and try to dissect the neck. Here uh, we can see the branches before uh -huh. Here he is uh, trying to uh, still uh, dissect uh, the around circumferential uh, dissection of the neck uh, is without proximal clip, yes? One, uh, one reason of the uh, many surgeons uh, put the temporal clip and do this uh, more more comfortable. But uh, in this case, uh, Dr. Chirian uh, don't want to put the proximal clip uh, because the presence of the uh, spasm, uh, really low flow, and do a uh, uh, thrombosis. So in this case, uh, don't we don't put uh, the proximal clip, uh, the proximal control, the uh, temporal control clip. I don't. I don't. Close. Yes. Fills. The SEG children that uh, the splice and the slow flow of the blood in the regions during the SEG uh, withering. So they can understand how much uh, slow flow and how much splice was affecting the brain at that time. Yeah, what they want to show is uh, that the vessels are in spasm and uh, 
the ICG, the flow is not very enthusiastic. So, it's very slow flow and very slow enhancement, the ICG. So, we wouldn't want to put anything that uh, would produce spasm. So, we, we had gone ahead and without any uh, temporary clip. So, we clip without any temporary clip. You will see that now. So we have to identify the branches. If you if you remember, the branches were uh, turning away from the aneurysmal dome. The aneurysmal dome was in continuation with the MCA, and the branches were turning away. So you will see this anatomy now. Yeah, you can close. Yes. Uh, here uh, he is trying to, to see the branches uh, in order to uh, preserve just uh, after put the clip. That's in a dark. Now we we go to see how is the branches. This is after second clip. Yes. Uh, yeah, one video is done. Yes, well, one will be the first. That's okay. Yeah, one video is left. It's okay. Uh, but the aneurysm is clipped, and then you can show the post op images. Okay. Here, okay. The patient experienced a, a left hemiparesis in the first 40, uh, 24 hours for surgery. Uh, managed uh, with hydration and elevation of the blood pressure, blood pressure, and complete recover uh, in the next eight hours. The patient uh, uh, in, in the morning have, have no, has no, no deficit. This is the CT scan after surgery. Here, here can you see the uh, home field effect of the clip, both, both, both clip. Yes, yes, we can see uh, there is no infarct uh, or sign signs for in brain infarct that tell us uh, the branches is good. The branches uh, was not touched. This is the patient today, three days uh, after uh, surgery. A perfect a patient uh, have a good, like we see here, a symmetric uh, power strain, a 15 point a GCS, a, with no deficit and no a nerve, a nerve a pulse. The patient a, a doing very, very well. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. You can stop sharing. Stop. Stop. Uh, Bye, guys. Oh, sure. Yeah. Dr. John? Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. Any question? Thank you. Very interesting. Okay, very good. Uh, I'm so, okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, go ahead. Banta. Banta. 
Yes, thank you very much for your nice presentation. I see on your CT scan post of you make a very uh, uh, much big uh, craniotomy. And it is my command. And I have only one question about how do you manage the facial nerve? So you do a one layer or two layer skin flap. How, how okay? How what? Did you hear the question okay? I, I, I don't hear. Uh, okay, once again, once again, Vantha, please. Yeah, the question is how do you manage the facial nerve? Facial nerve. So you do ah, one, layer, one layer or two layer uh, skin flap? Two layers. Uh, we do, uh, yes. Okay. Those layers. Two layers. Dos, dos, dos capas. <laughs> okay, Duong, do you have any comments or questions? No, I have no comment. Okay. The, uh, uh, we can, we, we need to say that the, uh, this case to Dr. Syrian that have a lot of experience, it was uh, one of the uh, uh, most difficult case to to do, to perform the correct clipping, because the patient have a, a uncommon anatomy, the patient have a, a, a pre-surgery pre spasm, so uh, the, uh, the patient have many, many factors that influence in the difficult of this surgery. Sorry, I have question, please. Go ahead. Yes. Yeah. Uh, do you uh, mix the papa varin in the water to wash out the 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 the, 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 the hematome or not? Was it, uh, Unfortunately, papa uh, varin is not available here. It will be a good option to use it to prevent the spasm, most important spasm. But uh, unfortunately, it was not available, so we. Uh, Without. Can, can, can you repeat your answer, please? The, 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 the papering is not available here, but it's a good tool. It is a, if you can uh, uh, have uh, do, uh, use, it's very useful. Ah, yeah. And one more question about the medical management. Uh, what, what, uh, what about your opinion uh, in using the deep body pin you use in the um, intravenous or oral knee body pin for this patient? The pin uh, use the oral pin usually. 60 milligram knee yeah. oral every four hours. And also the elevation of blood pressure, keep uh, blood pressure above uh, 150 over 90. Okay. To allow good uh, cerebral blood flow and prevent ischemia. Uh, why, why, why don't you choose the uh, intravenous? What? What? Why, why don't you choose the intravenous nimodipine? Why? In the why? patient who have the uh, subarachnoid. Uh, there are one from the market uh, way ago. Uh, it was uh, related to a renal uh, impairment in some cases, as I remember. But I'm not sure about the information. Now, uh, let me answer this one. Go ahead. Guys, uh, one of the main things that uh, in MC or any aneurysm surgery, one thing you've got to remember is uh, good surgery is the best option. You put proximal clips, you... Uh, you take veins, you don't remove the subarachnoid hemorrhage properly, or you apply repeated clips, this is not good. Whether you put papaverin, whether you put nimodipin, whatever you put. For a surgeon, the best option is to handle the aneurysm in the most, the, 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 in the best way possible. So, if you are not handling the vessels, you can... Uh, what I think is you can put papaverin, nimodipin, or whatever you think, and then pray. So the point should be handling the vessel, uh, handling the brain, 
handling the vessel and after that maybe you you really don't need anything we had severe m1 spasm if you saw we had severe m1 spasm so we did not put the temporary clip we identified the entire m1 tree and after that i put in i put in the clip quite far away from the branches we preserved the branches now if i had a spasm if i had a hemiparesis uh, which would last then i would go open i would take off the clips i will massage the mca allow back bleeding and then i will put the clip back again um, i i don't know how much intravenous nimodipine or uh, papaverin papaverin for sure it helps but unfortunately it is not available here and uh, it is not uh, cleared by the nepalese uh, fda uh, to use in my center unfortunately so but um, this nimodipine and rest of the things is only second to the handling of the vessel and your surgical technique this is very important thank you i Thank you. Hey, any more comments or questions from Duong or Vanta? Okay. Well, Eugenio, how, uh, how do you like uh, Nepal? How I like? Uh, Le gusta Nepal. Como se parece Nepal? Great, 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 great country. Beautiful country. Yeah. Yesterday. We go with the with the bus uh, to the hills. Oh, okay. You, Very you, nice. Have Very you nice. tried? Have you tried eating momo? Momo? Momo, no. Uh, co uh, chom uh, gomba. Uh, what is the drink? <laughs> Tomba. Oh, okay. <laughs> try try momo. It, it took momo. me a while, it took me a while to to like it, but I, I I really liked it before I left. I was there for three months. But yes, there's a place a block away uh, from there. <laughs> can we please meet uh, Ahmed uh, and the other gentleman there? Uh, can we yes, please yes, meet uh, them? Mr. Yes, Mr. John, I'm here. Ahmed, I'm yes. sorry I put the wrong picture there. I corrected it. Hello, how are you? Oh, good, how are you doing? So where are you from? I'm from Yemen. Okay, you work with... Uh, um, uh, who's who's the gentleman that said we we know we broadcast to Yemen? I don't know if you were there at the conference. Uh, were you there when I was broadcasting yes. to Yemen? Doctor Ismail Kipsi. Yes. Yes. Doctor Ismail Kipsi. He's our head of department. He's a very nice neurosurgeon and very experienced. Yes. So we had a Brazilian neurosurgeon come there and present. A Spanish neurosurgeon come there to present. Uh, now, we, there's there another fellow there we haven't met yet. Is there another fellow there with you guys, with Ahmed and yes. uh, Eugenio? Can yes. we meet him? Can we meet him, please? Yes. This one is here. Hello. Hello. Hi, could you please introduce yourself? Hi. Hi. What's your name and where are you from? My name is Juan Lopez, uh, from Venezuela. Oh, wow. Dos residentes de Venezuela. Oh, my God. Por Dios. Yes. <laughs> no, there's, there's not many Mexican, not many Spanish restaurants there in Nepal. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. But, but, uh, it's, uh, uh, it's a really nice place in, here in the Nobel Medical School Hospital. Uh, the area of the neurosurgery is amazing. Maybe in one opportunity we can do a presentation, show you the, the OT, show you the service. Uh, yes. This is uh, really, really amazing that, that Dr. Chirian doing here. Yes, I, I, I was there for three months, uh, Eugenio, and I saw it's, uh -huh. a, it's a really a great neurosurgical center and you guys must be excited to be there yes. uh, especially now especially now where it's not really crowded you get you get a lot of personal attention and you guys yes. are probably getting a lot of experience now i may come over there again uh in a month a couple of months to kind of okay. ho hopefully to try to set up uh the, the video and broadcasting endoscopy and from the microscope hopefully 
Um, okay. I, I think I may come over there, and I'm going to talk to Ipe about that. Um, okay. But uh, sometimes it's easier to do things when you're there. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's difficult from here to, to arrange it. Because certainly, just like we're broadcasting you guys now, we're able to broadcast directly from the, as you know, from the microscope and directly from an endoscope. Okay. Because they have the equipment there. They have a camera, uh, camera equipment. Uh, the Storts or uh, some other company has a, a lot of video, video equipment there. So, uh, is Ipe still? Is he? Is he all done? Is he gone? He's gone already. Yes. He's, he, he's here. Okay. Doctor Shirin. Okay, he's busy. Okay. Well, I appreciate. I appreciate you guys uh, broadcasting. Y también, uh, Ahmed, we, we, yes, can, yes. we can do a broadcast in Arabic if you'd like sometimes, if you want to, oh, do, very good. Yeah, if, if you want to present a, a case in Arabic, uh, you're welcome to, just let me know, just like okay. we're doing, just like we're doing now. Oh, there's, you know, a, there's yeah. Amir, Amir, I don't think, uh, have you introduced yourself? I'm a I'm a good afternoon. Okay. Good. Could My name is Amr, and uh, I think I know all, all of uh, you. Dr. Ahmed, Dr. Wantha, John Banik, and uh, Dung. Dung, 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 from Vietnam. My name is Amr Badran. I'm yeah. From Vietnam. yeah, you're originally from Jordan, correct, Amr? Yes, yes. yes. Uh, he's a Jordanian and practicing in the Ukraine. Yeah. Oh, okay. Nice How to meet you. How is Ramadan? Nice. With you? nice to meet you. How is Ramadan in Ukraine? Oh, yeah, Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> okay, see, there you go, Amir. Uh, uh, there you go, uh, Ahmed. Uh, you got your first person on your on your webcast there uh, for, for oh, yes. Arabic. Because uh, we have okay. mixtures of language. We've done webcasts in Russian. Uh, I think Amir came, uh, and we can do any language. Uh, you know, maybe next time, uh, John, maybe next time we have uh, one case uh, in the school, and it's also recorded. We can present uh, in Arabic. Okay, here's, I want you to meet Mo, uh, Moki from Africa. He, I, I think um, uh, Mujahid, can you hear me okay? Uh, he's having yeah, some yeah. technical Hello, time. hello, John. Okay. Unfortunately, today I have uh, um, a lot of technical issues, but I enjoy uh, the presentation. Thank you, uh, Dr. Rai. Thank you for all uh, uh, people here. Yes. I'm uh, Mujahid Imam, resident from uh, Africa. <coughs> also, I can speak Arabic, I think, from Bankary. <laughs> yeah. Hello, Marhaba. Okay, I can speak Arabic, John. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Mujahid is from Sudan. He's got an ambitious yeah. group of uh, neuros. He's got an ambitious group of neurosurgeons from uh, Sudan, and every Tuesday they have a grand rounds, and we hope to have yeah, the grand yeah. rounds continually. Yeah, yeah, but if we stop uh, this month because Holy Month Ramadan. Uh, we do not do meetings uh, in Ramadan, but we will start again in uh, next uh, July, I think. Next July. Very good. Yeah, it's uh, hopefully we'll have it. Well, I guess we won't be having it this Tuesday, right, Mogi? This Tuesday? Uh, we're not going to have it Tuesday, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, very good. Uh, I gotta catch up on the on the holiday uh, schedule of everyone. Uh, okay, very good. Um, so everyone's met everyone else. That's the power of this type of platform. Uh, you guys, uh, you meet people from all over the world, and uh, we hope to continue to develop it. We'll get better. And uh, we have we have a good channel in Spanish. We have a big uh, conference on stroke. On the 17th of June, Eugenio, I'll send you the schedule. I don't know if you see it, but we want to have to do the same thing in Arabic and, and every other languages. Um, uh, we'd like to continue to have it in people's own native language if they prefer. 
uh, I know the I know the language is English for neurosurgery, but even mm -hmm. uh, Vanta, we could have it in, Cam in in Cambodia in the language that you speak. Uh, Vanta, what is it? What's the language in uh, Cambodia? Is it uh, Cambodian, or what's the language there? What's the main language? Uh, the main language is Khmer. It's Cambodia. Oh, okay. Yes. You know, and the same extends to you if you want to have a web chat in your language, your native language. Oh, French. Uh, do you you speak French? Correct. Yeah, I speak French too. Okay. I I met a neurosurgeon last night from Romania. That, tra yeah. that trained in France, and he wants to be a part of this. So he wants to start a French, French community of having webcasts in French. Yeah. Uh, so and, and certainly, uh, and in Africa also, there's a lot of people that speak French. I'm very surprised uh, <laughs> that many countries in Africa speak French. Guys, see you. Thank you, and I'll, uh, I'll carry on. Uh, I, Ipe, can I yeah. can I say something to you? Yeah, man. Yeah, I, I, I may want to come to Nepal in a month or two to kind of get the sure. to, to try to get For the sure. video to try to get the video thing going, you know, to get the endoscopy, the mic uh, <coughs> televising from the microscope, etc. It's possible now. It's possible now. It's easily possible now. Okay, we'll we'll keep we'll talk about it. Okay. You come down. I'm off. Uh, <coughs> off to Europe for <coughs> in June. Okay, well, we'll talk about it, I, we'll get a good time, but I'd like to come over yeah. there and get things going there. So, see you, see you around. Okay, I have a good trip, and th thanks, everybody. Thank you, John.